What is going on guys? Mike here back with another video and in today's video we're we'll playing for Five Nights at Freddy's 2. Now you may be wondering, where's Pizza Rio Simulator? What happened to that? Well I decided to take a break from it because it's really kind of um getting pretty hard and I just wanted a break from making those videos because they took forever to edit. So I'm just gonna play FNAF 2. I haven't played this in like a month, so better pay attention. Just, like I'm I better pay attention. Cause I have I kinda forgot how to play. I mean, it's pretty easy. But I forgot some of the characters' mechanics and how they work. So let's get right into this. Help wanted. Grand reopening. Vintage pizzeria given new life. Come be a part of the new face of Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. What could go wrong? One hundred dollars and fifty cents a week to apply. Call one five five Faz Fazbear. I think that's what it said. I don't know. Got your D's. Your flashlight. She would make a but most importantly, a video game because they're all tied into some kind of criminal database so they can detect a predator a mile away. Hey, we should be paying them to guard you. Uh, now, that being said, no new system is without its kinks. Uh, you're only the second guard to work at that location. Uh, the first guy finished his week, but complained about conditions. All right. Uh, we switched him over to the day shift. So, hey, lucky you, right? Uh, mainly he expressed concern that certain characters seem to move around at night right. and even attempted to get into his office. Now, from what we know, that should be impossible. Uh, that restaurant should be the safest place mm, on Earth. I don't so, think so while our engineers don't really have an explanation for this, the working theory is that the robots were never given a proper night mode. So when it gets right. quiet, they think they're in the wrong room. So then they go try to find where the people are, and in this case, that's your office. So our temporary solution is this. There's a music box over by the prize counter, and it's rigged to be wound up remotely. So just every once in a while, switch over to the prize counter video feed and wind it up for a few right. seconds. Yeah, this is it doesn't seem to affect all of the animatronics, but it does affect one of them. Uh, and as for the rest of them, we have an even easier solution. You see, there may be a minor glitch in the system, something about robots saying you as an endoskeleton without a costume on and wanting to stuff you into the suit. So hey, we've given you an empty Freddy Fazbear head. Problem solved. You can put it on any time and leave it on for as long as you want. Eventually anything that wandered in will wander back out. Uh, something else worth mentioning is kind of the quartz modern design of the building. You may have noticed there are no doors for you to close. <laughs> Uh, but hey, you have a light, and even though your flashlight can run out of power, the building cannot. All so right, don't worry about the place going dark. Well, I think that's it. Uh, you should be golden. Uh, check the light, put on the Freddy head if you need to. Uh, keep the music box wound up. Piece of cake. Have a good night, and I'll talk to you tomorrow. Well, guys, this should be pretty easy. Um, you know, um... Have anything to Ooh, they're already gone. Oh no. You're there, you're there. I wish you could see Foxy and Golden Freddy. Rut row. Red. Oh, it's just Toy Freddy. Whoa. Hello there. Nathan. Good old Toy Freddy. He didn't want to do anything.
his Twitch. I'm sorry for not uploading. I my phone was running out of storage and I couldn't make videos. So that's gonna wrap up this video. If you enjoyed it, make sure to drop a like and subscribe for more. And I hope to see you all in the next one. Goodbye.